Tonight, we're going to bring you a rescue story out of Powell County that thankfully has a happy end. Yesterday, an experienced camper in his late 20s was gathering firewood for his campsite on a cliff line of the Twin Arch Trail at the Red River Gorge when he fell backwards down that cliff. LEX 18's Claire Kopsky spoke with the rescue team. That's our big story tonight at 5 It's been a devastating night. I fell over there and had to grab onto that branch hurt. But I'm glad it didn't break because this goes all the way down there and then all the way down another ledge outside of these trees. <sighs> but I'm just in a little cubby hole and uh, I can't get back up. He couldn't get back up, so he called for help with a cell phone that survived the at least 20 foot fall. Powell County Search and Rescue Incident Command team member Lisa Johnson says it's rare for someone to have a working phone when they need help, but she's thankful that he did as it helped her team of 30 find him in the treacherous spot fairly quickly. That was one of the highest points that I've ever been to. The guy said that they could see all of the gorge. That's how high it was up. This was a tough one. This was a, the terrain was something else. I mean, it's all rock. Johnson hopes all will take this success story as a reminder to go on your hike prepared with a backpack full of anything that you'd need for the night, including water, any medications you take, and a whistle. It doesn't matter how experienced you are. It's This is what I tell people. I'm an experienced climber. I'm an experienced All it takes is a second. And he said, I don't know what happened. He fell backwards out of nowhere, just fell backwards. Um, it just takes a second. Johnson says beyond the man surviving with only a few scrapes, the best part is that he's decided to join the Powell County Search and Rescue Team to help future stranded hikers. This gentleman was lucky. We're getting him on our team, so we're lucky. But it all worked out great. In Powell County, Claire Kopsky, LEX 18 News.